My husband and I recently took a trip to Granville, Ohio to celebrate our seventh wedding anniversary. So I thought I would take you guys along and show you what all we did on this weekend. This is the inn that we stayed at. It's called the Granville Inn and it's this beautiful historic inn built in the 1920s and it was just a beautiful place to stay. They have a restaurant, a bar, and you can have events here, which I thought was really cool. So I'll show you more about that later. Once we were situated, we actually went to the restaurant at the inn and I ordered a lamb shank and Andrew had the steak. I was not a big fan of the lamb shank, to be honest. I did not think it had too much flavor, but Andrew's steak was amazing. And I love zooming in on Andrew's face. <laughs> He's so cute. But the the inn, as you can tell, is just so beautiful from the outside, the inside. I definitely recommend staying here if you come to Granville. We went to the bar at the inn and I ordered a margarita and this was one of the best margaritas I have ever had. Saturday morning we had brunch and I ordered eggs benedict which is one of my favorite things to have for breakfast and Andrew actually ordered a red mimosa which is basically champagne and cranberry juice. I am not a fan of cranberry juice or champagne so I didn't like this. However, I am a very very huge fan of coffee so I had coffee maybe like two to three times a day. Something I learned about this city is that Michael Scott or Steve Carell of The Office went to Denison University that is in Granville. Um, this is a beautiful, beautiful university which Andrew looked up the price for a year and it was like $57,000 just for one year. And as we were walking, we saw some adorable little deer just chilling in the grass, which was so nice to see. After touring the university, I really needed some coffee, so we walked to this coffee house called River Road Coffee House, and I thought it was really cute, and I was so sweaty because I think we walked like 20 minutes from the university to the coffee shop, and then we found a really cute bookstore. The name of this store is the Reader's Garden Bookstore. And I thought it was really cute with all of the artwork and just the flowers and everything. It was really sweet. Andrew really wanted to go to a cidery. So we went to the Seek No Further Cidery. And I got a cider slushie and Andrew got a flight of ciders for us to try. And it was very delicious. If you guys are ever in Granville, I hope that you have fun because Andrew and I had a lot of fun it was a cute little town reminded me of stars hollow then we finished off our day at broadway pub which was delicious so i hope to see you in the next video thank you for watching